What's up, Unix? This is Cobalt Steel, and welcome to Cobalt Plays Super Mario Land, released on the Game Boy in 1989 as a launch title. Although I'm going to be playing this on the 3DS Virtual Console. This is episode 1, and we are in the Birabuto Kingdom. I just found a bonus zone there. Um, this place is based off of Egypt, as you can see with the pyramids and palm trees. So, as you can see, this game takes several graphics, uh, graphical inspirations from Super Mario Bros. 1, but despite that, a lot of gameplay elements and other aesthetics are different. Uh, uh, something you're going to notice here is the, um, you have to get that one coin. Something you're going to notice is the 1-ups, which there's one here, are shaped like hearts, and the fire flowers are actually super balls in this game. Super ball flowers. And you get a super ball from this. Uh, these things fly 45 degree angles. Because I'm pretty sure there was some difficulties programming arcs. I just found another bonus zone. Uh, I think there was difficulties programming balls that bounce in arcs. So... I guess that's something. There's also a similar situation with the uh, Koopa Troopas and their shells. Because they explode in this game. So I found a Starman. And as you can tell, instead of the typical music, you get the Can Can theme. Or Galloping Inferno, depending on what you want to call it. Um. So. <clears throat> um. This game was supposed to be a pack-in title for the Game Boy, but because but they switched it out for Tetris because Tetris appealed to a wider audience, while Mario mostly appealed to young kids. So anyway, here if you take the top door of this goal area, you get to play a bonus game of sorts. Um, as you can see, the bonus game has you pressing the A button or something at the right time to get whatever you want. I got three ups, which is the, I guess, the best prize. We also get a Super Ball Flower, which is only useful if you have, if you're in Small Mario. But yeah, so here we are in the second level, which is reminiscent of the treetops level in Super Mario Bros. The treetops levels, plural. But, uh, oh wait, wait, right. So as you could have saw there, um, I was, uh, I stomped on some Koopas. And there's someone outside. Um, I was stomping on Koopas, and they blew up. Oh, and here's one. You can see it in act. No, oh, I missed it. I do it. This is another post commentary uh, let's play. So that's so sorry about that. Um, I'm not going to be doing any more of these. Uh, the let's play after this is going to be my last post commentary let's play. So yeah, and even then, only two episodes our post commentary so that's so yeah anyway I got another three ups from that bonus game um and I'm in the final level yeah instead of four levels you get three levels per world I'm not sure why that is but okay so actually there's a there's a way you can get up there I think it's when you're Super Mario you can break the blocks and find a hidden path, and I dive because I want to see if I could get that. But there's a way, there's like a, I think you break one of those blocks, and there will be a block that reveals like some sort of elevator. And you can like ride it to the, that ceiling and get the coins. And there's a plane. Can that plane go away? 
So, um, I said, nope, forget. I went here to get some bonus blocks. Bonus blocks? Coins? Because it's a bonus room. Um. Yeah, and, and there's a super mushroom here, which is just perfect. I love it. So I want to know, um, Super Mario Odyssey is going to come out, like, next month. I want to know if you're excited for it. Do leave a comment in the video, if in the comment section, if you are excited. Because I sure am. Uh, that game looks great. And uh, here's an... Here, and I missed a secret. Oh, uh, wait, it's not this one. But, yeah, I'm excited. I mean, the game is like Mars 64 and Sunshine. Which is cool, because I love those games a lot. So I'm looking forward to that. But what about you? Leave a comment. So here, uh, this is that Elevator I was talking about. Uh, I'm not actually entirely sure that Elevator existed in the earlier parts of the level, but... It exists here. So anyway, you get an Elevator, you take that ceiling, you go down the pipe, and you get to the bonus zone. Which is this U-shaped area. And you can get a lot of coins. I don't... I, I try to see if there are any like hidden things in these areas, in those places, but there wasn't. So anyway, <clears throat> you could... You had three paths to take. You could, If you were small Mar, you could take the uh, lowest path and get some great coins. But I wasn't small Mario, but I became small Mario. That's just fantastic. Oh, and you probably wouldn't notice, but there was actually a like a like a falling platform behind that wall. And here we meet, we fight the boss, which is this lion, and I instantly defeat him because he's easy. It's basically the Super Mario Bros. One boss, but in lion form. So anyway, we finished. World 1, and we get to see if we can save Daisy. She, that's not Daisy, that's a, that's a Firefly, I think that's a Firefly, from Mario Bros, the arcade game. I have that game, it's pretty fun. So anyway, we took care of World 1, so that is it for today, see you later. Well, that is all for today, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more Cobalt Steel. Until next time, see you all later.